always enjoyed the Shangri-La for their tea and their tea wall in their main lobby, but they've recently introduced something on the third floor called the Bee Wall, and it ties into this Garden View suite. So the inspiration was I have a sea wall, my champagne wall, a tea wall, my tea wall, and I thought, what can I do next? Let's do a bee wall. Um, but then it became more than that because I started to fall in love with the bees. It's like <laughs> a, romant a romantic story about bees. I mean, the, the whole design this is a custom design that was made for the Shangri-La, uh, for this space really, for the guests to, 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 uh, to uh, uh, be able to, to enjoy it. We installed the hives, about 10,000 bees at the time, and the colony has grown since to up to 50,000 bees right now. I mean, this is a really important project because, because bees are, are going through a really hard time right now. Uh, we're losing about 50% of bees every year, so it's a huge number. And bees are responsible for, for pollinating about 40% of every single thing we eat. So without bees, it's no fruits and no veggies and things like that. Uh, so the idea here is to, to uh, illustrate that and show that to the guests and have them understand how important they are, but also how we can cohabitate with them and how uh, docile they can be. My ultimate goal now is to probably move into making alcohol from the honey, uh, doing a moonshine or something different. Um, everyone uses it for food. Now I'll go and possibly do something else with the honey. Um, but the true reason the bees are here is we need bees. This, this project is in a, a global movement of urban beekeeping, so bringing bees in the city because um, bees can survive very well in the city because there's no pesticides and there's a lot of different flowers that are very interesting. So it ties into this, this very nice movement uh, and I encourage people to, to, to adopt bees and to, to bring this movement to, uh, to their homes and to their businesses. This is really, uh, we hope this inspires people to do something, to take on beekeeping. Uh, I mean, this is a great sculpture. Uh, it's a great setup, obviously, for the hotel, uh, but it's very easy to set up a small beehive in a backyard. Uh, someone who has a garden, someone who has you know, a cottage or, or uh, a country home. Uh, so we do hope people get inspired and start doing their own beekeeping.